welcome back to my channel. It is that time again. It's time to open MC. So we got the Glam Bag and the Glam Bag Plus. Make sure I'm not showing you my address. <laughs> I am excited to dive in this month. Um, I believe this is my first unboxing with both at the same time. I'm positive of it because we had a little mix up last month. So we'll see how many eyeliners I get. <laughs> how many eyeliners will I get this month? That is the question. Comment below if you think you have a guess. If I'm gonna get two or one, or will this be the first month that I don't get an eyeliner? That will be mind-blowingly insane. <laughs> if you haven't already, you should definitely subscribe and hit the bell twice so that you know every time I upload a video. But let's get to it. Let's start with the regular glam bag. This video is a little late. I've had them for a while. For the first time ever, Ipsy shipped my um, stuff pretty fast, like in a decent amount of time. It's just I've been busy and I haven't been home to do this. So we're gonna do it now. Okay, um, the first thing I see is this pretty brush. It's really cute actually. It's like turquoise maybe. No, I think it's just green. We'll just go with green. <laughs> but it's really pretty and glittery. So I'm excited about that. I know some people feel like they've gotten a whole lot of brushes. I am still happy with getting brushes for now. Though, if you've seen my vanity tour, then you know I've got a nice amount of brushes as well. But uh, green is just Ipsy's color for this month, apparently. But I really love this bag, actually. It's really cute. I love the green with the gold accents and the studded effect on it. I really like it. This is probably my favorite bag that I've gotten. Let's go in it. All right, info card first, August 2019. Bear yourself. Um, and then on the back, I'm reading. <laughs> All right, I was reading. It says one more thing: add-ons on September 2nd. You can add extra products to your September glam bag starting at just three dollars. But hurry, supplies are limited and only available for 24 hours or until they sell out. If you've seen any of my other Ipsy unbaggings, I have been telling you about this for a while, but they decided to put it on the back of the card. I'm not gonna open the card. Well, I'll open it, but I'm not gonna look. So there's that, but I didn't look at it. So this, it just shows everything that's in this bag. We already know one of the items was that brush. Um, so this is a mineral body lotion. Pamper yourself with this body lotion for soft and smooth skin. Apply liberally morning and evening. Approved for sensitive skin. Um, it says Dead Sea Water. I'm really interested to see what the consistency of it looks like. I don't know. Like, I'm just weird and I want to see it. So, it just looks like regular lotion. It's pretty creamy, actually. It's not very thick. If you need thick lotion, then this isn't for you. It smells like a clean scent you know what I mean like if you ever um buy soap yeah it smells like soap to me instead of lotion like I'm almost second guessing but it feels good on my hand um estate eye shade I feel like I have a lot of estate eye colors Here's this one. The name of this color is Smash. And it's a pretty color, like bloop. I like that. It's really, really pretty. So I will for sure wear this one. As you know, sometimes the colors I don't really I don't really wear. I like having them, but I don't wear them. Um and then I got Jelly Shot Lip Quencher. Um, I'll show you. There you go. And then, per our usual, or per our last video, I'm gonna put close-ups over there, like I got a bad tick, but I'll put the close-ups of all products 
over here so you can see them while I open and talk about them. So I'm moving rather quickly today. So, okay, when I opened it, it looks like a little lipstick. Oh, it, oh, it really looks like a little clear lipstick with a little flower in it. I don't know how much you can see. As I said, definitely look over here so you can check and see it up close because I can't see you. I mean, I can't see what you see, so I don't know if you can see it in this frame. Um, another thing that I noticed this month that I don't remember ever getting the option to do before, and it probably has always been there, I just never knew. They, act, they let me pick an item for my bag, for each one, for my bag and my box. So I picked one item for each, each thing. <laughs> And so um, I was excited. There were only a few options to go with, but just to have a, ch a little choice was nice. Or you could just pick to let them pick. But I, um, of course, chose this Huda Beauty Lip Contour. It's um, in Trophy Wife. Um, I already have Trophy Wife the lipstick. So we got the lip liner to match. And I'm excited. I actually forgot what I had picked <laughs> until right now. So I, um, because I would definitely have put that on. Oh, no, because then I would have had to open the bag. Moving along, let's open our Glam Bag Plus. Full disclosure, mine is already open because my coworker wanted to see what I got. <laughs> So I let her open it, but she knows that I do these videos and I did not look and she did not spoil it. I promise. But let's open it up. Okay. So one of the things that I picked in, or not one of the things, the thing that I picked in my Glam Bag Plus is this palette. It's in the bottom of your hand. I was underwhelmed with the options for what I could pick in the box. So I just kind of picked one randomly, to be honest. I like palettes, I'm into palettes right now. So, but there were a couple palettes to choose from. So I just chose this one, it had a lot in it. In the bottom of your hand, who says you can't have it all? I just said, I just chose that one for that. Um, I'm gonna read off the shades for you. Remember to look over here for the uh, close up and extra detail. So we have Matt Reed which is a shadow. We have nude, which is a shadow as well. So all one, two, three, four, five shadows at the top. Um, oh no, four shadows and a luminizer, but I actually have this Mary Lou, Mary Luminizer already. But so one, two, three, four shadows, a luminizer, we have three blushes and a bronzer so it literally is everything and looking in this mirror with these lights it is obvious that i have on too much makeup <laughs> oh well we've already started but so there's that um all right i got the thrive cosmetics liquid lash extensions mascara for length and volume. Oh, look how impressive the picture is. They always try to sell it up, don't they? <laughs> With and without. Those are fake lashes. Quit playing with me. That is not just this mascara. Flake-free liquid fiber technology combines buildable fibers plus Korean plant extracts for instantly longer, thicker lashes and it encourages lash growth. Huh. If it does that, y'all, this is my new favorite. I will pay up to $40 for this mascara if it will do that with just the mascara. But I'm about positive she's wearing falsies. I hate, I hate when makeup companies do that. Or when hair companies will show you hair products, but then the girl in the advertisement is wearing extensions or weave and I'm thinking you're supposed to be showing me how your product enhanced her hair but whatever all right um liquid chrome illuminating drops I think I have enough highlighter now officially let me see it Ooh, 
Look at that package though. I feel like I have a sample, like a smaller version of this that's not as cute and impressive as, uh, as this one. I love that. It's so pretty. Look, now, I was like, I got enough of that. And then, ooh, look how pretty. I wanna know how much that costs though. This is probably the first time I haven't been giving you prices. So that was $26. The palette was $32. And the mascara was $24. I also got some oh, a hydration cream mask. I think I really like this brand. Everything I've tried from this brand, I've liked so far. This was worth $33. And then I got the Farrah Brushes 5-Piece Eye Perfection Set. So, okay, this is worth $48. Remember when I told you guys that um, I did my, I don't know, you probably didn't watch it. <laughs> I don't know. But um, in my vanity tour, I was saying that I wanted to buy new brushes for on top of my vanity. And then I'll put the other ones down below that don't match. So I kept saying I wanted to do the gold brushes. But this set is silver and it'll kind of match what I got going on already. I just want to pull one out. I feel like I have one of these already. From a sample it's soft it's good um so i might just do this brush set though i need a bigger maybe i'll try to add on to it like with a bigger like a blush brush just to make it look fuller but that'll save me that's probably a great idea i'm gonna try that out um one thing i will say is that this is a good way to save money on um makeup and skincare and also they'll do scents. I don't really get the perfumes and stuff often, but um, it's a really good way if you wanna try a higher end item without paying the higher end price, then definitely sign up for subscription boxes like Ipsy, like Sephora Play. I hate to add other people in this, in this review because this is an Ipsy review, but it's really just an unboxing. You already know my feelings on Ipsy overall. But, um, yeah, I'm all about helping everybody save money and having all the things that you want in life without breaking the bank. So Ipsy, like I said, the subscription boxes are a very good way to do that. Um, I paid $25 for the Glam Bag Plus and the hot, like I said, this palette is valued at $32. The the um, mascara is $24. The brushes are $48. The mask is $33. And this beautiful um, highlight, liquid highlighter is $26. So even just this one product, I could have bought this one product or that whole box of full size items. So it's definitely a good hack if you want higher end makeup and different brands um, to try out or just to have. Like I said, the if you just want to try things out before you buy them, then definitely opt for the bag. But if you want full size prices, because uh, yeah, if you want full size prices, then definitely opt for the full, the glam bag plus because then you get these full size items for a fraction of the cost, and it's a really good hack. Or your pocketbook. I don't know what that was. <laughs> I'm so tired, guys, that this is probably not my best, but thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Stick around, it gets better. I promise you, I have more tips for saving money and buying higher end items for cheaper prices, uh, more unboxings, more hauls. I'm gonna move into a couple of new things soon too. So definitely subscribe if you haven't already and like this video. Oh, quick kind of note. I was looking at playing back this video that I for real suffered through and I didn't get no eyeliner. Are you, are you serious? Like, can you believe that? Zero eyeliners in either one.